Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We are going in again. Last time we did Maggie. This time we have Kane. Kane's a weird one. We've done pretty well with him prior. Um, I'm not... I'm not entirely sure if we should play him now or not, though. I'm I'm concerned about that, so I, I'm not entirely sure. I just want to keep the streak alive right now, and Kane, I've clearly done well as him prior, so it's not that big of a risk. We could do the Beast. <sighs> this is I'm, I'm going to gamble. I'm going to gamble the streak on Tainted Kane here, which is certainly a, a risky move, I realise. Um... I'm going to grab that. Don't you dare. I'm going to grab one of those as well. Well, yeah. Okay. Got a good bit of stuff there. Uh, accidentally picked up a coin that was hidden and I got a hit as well. Very, very nice stuff. Luckily, as this uh, this fellow, we do start with slightly higher stats. It's rather nice because uh, we basically are Kane still. We still get Kane's extra stats. Unfortunately, we don't get Kane, uh, Kane's good pills, which is a shame. But we'll try, try our best to keep this going. This is a character that can be really good but I tend to kind of fail at pretty often um basically I took the money for uh buying HP if you're wondering why I took the dime because obviously the dime's pretty useful but also because um if we can get items in the shop then that would be pretty good I will suck that up because um we're looking pretty good on that front this guy's going to give us a good amount of bombs good thing about him doing that is it just clears up so much space for us to uh actually be able to shoot him you basically removed all of your defenses, my ladder. Kind of stopped yourself from being able to do much there, haven't you? And for some reason, you're not even planting any bombs right now. Double bombs. I'm going to take the double bombs. Early on, I think it's better to like get a nice baseline of consumables and stuff that you can work with. And then, excuse me, you just landed on me, you prick. <laughs> I didn't even realise you existed. Uh, I'm going to try and buy a red heart in here. It's not particularly good. Okay, I'll buy the soul heart instead. Um, thank you. Um, and I'll try and get an extra penny if we can and buy that uh, that item. Because that'll be some good stuff for us. But only seven cent. Dude, if I'm going to try and keep my streak alive, I need to play a little bit better than this. Because right now I'm playing like hot dookie. I've got to say, playing like hot dookie. Dude, what did I just say about getting an extra penny? What did I what did I just say about getting an extra penny? And then immediately I'm like, ooh, an extra penny. Better suck that up. <laughs> Anyways, that's for the question of the day today. Honestly, I've recorded like four Isaac episodes today, so I'm kind of <laughs> question of the day. I'm 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 not really seeing clear. Um I'll be honest. Let's just quickly take another look around this floor, see if there's anything else we want to grab real quick. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm trying to think of what we could do for question of the day here. Um, hmm. What's been a disappointment for you recently? Just in general. Hopefully we can keep the streak alive here with this boss, but I'm not particularly enthused about my current level of HP. Um, we'll see, we'll see. We shall see. But yeah, remember, if we get a penny, try and take it. Not particularly happy with this guy. He does his little bonk move, of which I tend to get hit by a lot. I don't know why he makes a bonk sound when he does it, but he does. Okay, so there's a penny. Dude, I picked up both by accident. I'm not a fan of how this is going so far. This is a really, really slow fight against this guy. Really, really slow fight against this guy. Okay, he is in the second phase now, at least. Although, second phase, I'm not really sure if I prefer or not. <laughs> Dude, I mistimed the bomb. Are you kidding me? I used a bomb on him, and it literally did, like, no damage whatsoever. Dude, no way that hit me. Thank God we don't actually get to have to keep the item he gives us, though. Okay, please give us a red heart here. Thank you, you did. Um, I will suck up this bomb. Great Jesus juice, I'm reasonably happy with that. Uh, I'll suck up the nickel as well. Let's go and buy the school bag. Not enthused about my current HP, I'll be honest, but overall, it is what it is. 
Okay, got pretty much the same again here. I'll pick up that, that. I'll just, I'll just pick all of these up. Okay. Good to go. Right, let's carry on. By the way, I apologise if you can hear my fan in the background. It is what it is. It's still quite warm in the UK, so I'm just having to deal with it. Uh, but yeah, see how this goes. We should get an item here straight away off of the back of this. Good, good. Um, Luck Penny. I'll take the Luck Penny in. This better be good. I'm taking up some really, really good stuff here. Mr. Mega? Um, not too enthused about. Anti-grav I'll take. And you may all be thinking, that's crazy. But one whole extra fire rate for having to tap shoot. Or um, if you want to save him up and fire him, you can. But I prefer to just tap shoot most of the time. It's pretty good. It has some interesting synergies as well. I'll take the key. I'd rather have some key backups. Probably not going to get Devil Deal here, I'll be honest. But we'll see. Right. Shoot that down. Ooh, okay. Already not enthused about this situation. Good thing is, I can take out the Pooters reasonably reliably and they're the biggest threat here. Just got to be careful for the, the flies that split. Because they can split and then kind of throw the flies at you. Like that. Which is really annoying. But overall, this room is actually super easy. Ain't no chance of getting hit here. I say that as I almost walk directly into that worm there. That would have been so stupid if I got hit then. Right, good, good. Taking another key. It's kind of interesting because this guy, you can get more items. Uh, but it just, it really depends on your luck. In terms of what items you get. I realise there is some method to the madness in terms of crafting items. But it's not it's not an exact science really. It is still pretty random I think. Got a lot of poops here. That's good. Potentially a penny in here somewhere. We get the hammer. I'll take the hammer. I can't remember exactly how the hammer works. I'll be honest. Um... On use, tiers are replaced by numbers 1 through 9 for the current room. Tiers damage scale uh, based on the numbers. Yeah, interesting. Don't know how good it is, but it's interesting, certainly. Okay, yeah, I was just about to say, there's no way I don't take damage here. I kind of backed myself into a corner there. Not my fault, though. Definitely not my fault. Kind of an interesting one with anti-grav here, because we can have these guys essentially jump into the tiers that we leave behind. We've managed to escape. Dude, we're getting nickels like crazy. Probably should just take them for the money, to be honest, but... I don't know. Okay, this item's pretty good. Basically a bunch of different tier effects. I like that. Troll bomb? How dare you? Um, yeah, just take it all. Quickly go and check. Ah, oh, that's the second luck penny. I mean, maybe shouldn't be sucking up luck pennies. It is what it is, though. Um, should potentially look for secret room here. I'm not entirely sure on where it is. Why can't I move while holding tab as this guy? What's that about? F3 to hide that. Okay, there, there you go. It works now. Um... I think it's here, but I'm not entirely sure. Ah, balls. I should probably go and do this extra room, to be honest. I really should be min-maxing the hell out of this guy whenever I can. Any extra items we can get our hands on is going to be very, very useful. Room clear rewards, obviously, are our funds for creating items. Don't know why I picked that up. That would have been an item there. Don't like this guy creating all the, the, the poops that can shoot me. I gotta say. There you go. Mysterious Gift, unfortunately, isn't ideal because that will replace our current active, and I'm pretty happy with my current active. So, not, not great. Okay, now this is tricky because we've got all the bouncies, all the mushrooms. I don't know how he reacts to being, like, walking into the mushrooms. I think it's fine, personally, but still, this is going to be rather tricky. 
because there is times where this guy explodes into shots. I honestly don't remember when he explodes into shots, I'll be honest. Ah, there you go, I got hit by one of them there. It's on certain splits, but I'm not sure which ones. Yeah, I got hit again there, dude. This, this isn't good. Dude, okay, let's be careful here. That was really close. We got a trinket there that I can get at least, okay. Okay, things are not not looking too hot right now, I've got to say. Um, I don't really think we have a way out right now either, which is not ideal. Thought I'd come in here to check for something, but I don't really know what. I could have bought a heart if I had one more penny. If I had a bomb, I could blow up the donation machine. This is not being ideal. Not being ideal. Now, I could... I could... Create my active... This is, this is probably a bad move, but I'm going to do this anyways. I could use this to generate, and that's, that's exactly what I was hoping for, just to hope for some HP. Not not a great thing to do, but it saves my life for now. And I can hold on to Mysterious Gift until I get to a secret room. Yeah, not ideal, but that's what I was, I was hoping for a red heart, to be honest, but I got a soul heart, which is probably a little bit better. Okay, let's keep it moving on. Not the most ideal at all, but we saved our own life there. I'm proud of myself for doing it. This Basically, at this point, the streak is literally all that matters. I don't care if we don't get any completion marks as this guy. I want my streak to stay alive. A really hard time killing that dude. But we got these little things here. These little things can be quite good. This is very nice. I'm just going to take both of those because I need the HP right now. Yeah, these little dudes, basically, we can shoot them around. They'll dive at enemies. They don't last very long, but that's because the trinket version of this. I wonder what would happen if I picked that up. Would that count as a sack? I'm guessing it would. Some bees there, nice. You can come through this gap if you want, but I'm going to cover it in crap. I'm going to cover it in tears so you can't do much. Yeah, they do, they do a nice bit of extra damage for us. It's not a lot, but it's something. Uh, okay, I'll be taking both the soul hearts, thank you. Um, and one bomb. Honestly, I'm lowering my amount of items I'm getting overall, but increasing my safety, it, like I said, it's my primary concern right now, so... We'll get items along the way. I mean, rooms like that go a long way to helping. I took the bomb because we really want to find a um, secret room if we can. We should have taken the luck pennies, really. Increasing our luck start, getting more room drops is very, very useful for us. I wasn't really thinking at the time. I was thinking, ooh, a better item. And the second luck penny, I genuinely just didn't see. Good, good. Members card, I don't think is that worthwhile, to be honest. Because we're just we're not going to have a lot of money over the course of this run as I see it. We can't suck up trinkets, I don't think. Yeah. You're the riskiest bisky. Toy drum, I will take. Most definitely. We've had that quite a few times. It's pretty good. Holy shit. Not quite sure what happened there, but... Happy it happened, really, I think. <laughs> okay, secret room is likely to be right here. I'm going to do a, a triple pass to check this. So, yep, that can be valid. And we'll check this room as well. Yep, it's valid in here as well. So that's almost definitely secret room. We'll do that. And I've just had a thought. Mysterious Gift actually isn't that good here, because it just, yeah. <laughs> it just turns them into uh, thingies. But, we, oh, we can get another toy drum. I, I don't think they'd stack, so I'm not going to do that. It'd be kind of weird that we got another toy drum already, though. Wow. But yeah, I highly doubt they stack, so I'm not going to bother with that right now. Not particularly enthused about this room. Not a lot of space to move around. And these mushroom guys can be particularly treacherous. 
I'm actually really glad that I got anti-grab. I think anti-grab was a great grab. Not not something that most people would take, I, I wouldn't think, but I'm very glad I did. Multiple hands about. The hands are kind of annoying, but we can deal. Right, boss time. Kind of an annoying boss here because we get the uh, the dippies. Luckily, he sucks most of them up like that. Luckily as well, we have okay damage right now. And periodically, Toy Drum gives us more. If it did stack, I'd wonder what it would do, do. Maybe it would just uh, give us more damage when it triggers. Or maybe it would um, trigger more often, but... I'm honestly unsure and I don't want to risk it, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna bother fucking with something I don't I don't understand. We're doing perfectly good damage to this guy right now, so I don't wanna waste my uh hard end stuff on an item that I might not need. Anyways, we got him nice and deaded. Uh I'll take that first. This is a pretty bad item, so I'll take that. Smelter, I will take. Smelter's pretty good. Did we have another trinket? We did. What was that other trinket? I don't remember what this was, uh, but it's worth going to see because, like I said, we do have um, Smelter now. But Penny, obviously not great, but I think it does actually give you um, some benefit. 20% higher chance for coin. Yeah, 20% higher chance for coins to spawn from poop. It's not much, but it's something. Um, so let's ca carry on going down here. You see, this is... Anything that's going to give us more items, I think, is is super, super valuable. Even just 20% for the annoyance of what but, um, thingy does. But also, we'll get more um, thingy drops here. We definitely don't want to go Stephen Floor here, because trading our items away is just a terrible, terrible idea. I really don't think that's going to be very beneficial to us at all. One interesting thing about Toy Drum here is because of anti-grav, we're hitting the toy drum shots more often. Dude, can I stop getting troll bombs, please? These are all bombs that could be real bombs that I'm not getting. Um, I don't think booster pack's really that valuable. I keep getting uh, bees for some reason. I'm, I'm, I think that's from my trinket, maybe, but I'm not entirely sure, I'll be honest. Good. I don't think we can get to any of those. Um, speedball. Not really worth it, I don't think. But yeah, I feel like I'm hitting my toy drum shots way more often. That's a good trinket as well. Proptosis is the better item, so it should give us better stuff. Devil's Mask? I can't remember what this does now. Fierce Mask. Um, hold up. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna undo that because we got how to jump. Give Smelter. I don't know why we got how to jump there, but that is of course not what we should have got. Um, I'll also spawn myself in some stuff. Spawn. Penny. Yeah. And we'll... We'll just sort of roll on from that, I think. I know that seems a bit cheesy, but... I don't know what that is. Dead weight, I think it's called that. I don't know if it's an active item. I'm not going to bother with it for now. Yeah, that was a bit bullshit. Um, it's an item with a broken ID from the from the Job mod that it just didn't let us have. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna have Smelter disappear for that. Broken ID items messing with me. Drop bomb here. We just got the item back that we got rid of before. Key. Speedball's back. I, I don't know. Speedball's just not good enough. It's not bad, but like our speed is fine right now. I just, I feel like we ought to save for something a little bit better.
Booster pack again. I suppose let, let's use booster pack. Basically, all I'm thinking is we've got a bunch of cards to put in it. And we could get something that gives us more. Um, so put that in there. Put that in there. Them two in there. And take this one. Good thing is we've not really been hit much recently. I like that. All cards, baby. This is going to make rocks into Midas touch. So we really need a, a, a we need more bombs before we bother working with this. I'm getting bees randomly. I'm still confused by that. Oh, I should have taken that key, really. I'm, I have no keys right now. But this is going to be a slightly somber run, I think. Slightly slowed down compared to a regular run. Because I'm just going to be playing really cautiously to make sure I get a win here. We are going to try go Beast Path. I will take that. Really, I should be popping these poops as well. Because I think they still have a chance of give us, giving us pennies. I'm not entirely sure on that. Good. The annoying enemies are gone now, just the explosive ones. No pennies. Come on now. Boom. Really? That that stuff there gives you forever alone? Are you kidding me? Okay, wait a minute. I hate having a card when you're trying to reorganize your shit. Ah, oh, this is gross. It's giving us such bad stuff. All these cards and that's the sort of stuff you're going to give me? Really? Just rude. Oh, froggies, can you... Can you not? Take out the little blue fellas. Froggy, what... What are you doing and where are you? Because you're, you're really frustrating me at this point. We got you. We got a chest. Which had another chest in it. Which had a trinket in it. Actually a pretty good trinket. Can't be mad about that. Right, it's boss time. Gotta remember we gotta kill his minions before we can do any damage to him. We got a lot of these little seedling fellas chilling with us right now. It's kind of nice. They seem to do pretty good damage for a trinket. This guy is still a boss I don't really understand. He's been reworked and I'm still a little unsure exactly sort of how to play him. I think I did that right. Seems, seems to me like I did. Just some of his attacks like this one that I don't know what to do. <laughs> right. Alright, drop my fucking card again. This card is pissing me right off. The way that that works is so frustrating. Right. Take a bomb instead of that. Just awful game. Get rid of one card, I guess. Nope, get rid of two cards by accident. Belly button? Belly buttons? This is just... No, this is gross. This has been worthless. I I just... This is, this is the thing I hate about this character. You can have some absolutely banging items in your bag and it's like, forever alone, take it or leave it. It's like, why? Like, how, how can you give me such a terrible tier item for the stuff that I have offered here? Not even remotely fair. Pay to win. Why? Smelter again. <laughs> Fucking really? There you go. Something good, finally. Good golly gosh, that was annoying. Also, we can smelt this now. Card in the bag. <sighs> Stressful, man. Stressful. 
We need another key, but that is worth it. We got a tiny boy here. Gotta be careful for him because I can't really see him very well. Oh my god, I'm having such a hard time hitting these guys. There you go. Keys, like I said, we need. We need one more key. Ayo. Fortunately, I can't get that, but I can put it in my bag at least. As I can with that as well. But yeah, basically get rid of all um, all of those boys and it gives us a black heart potential chance when we destroy one. Really, really good. Like the Pac-Man Waka Waka challenge. You're just eating up all my pellets. Can you stop bouncing yourself away from my damage, please? Thank you. Oh my god, that was stupid. Wasn't really paying attention to what the enemies were doing there. Okay. Oh god, this run's stressful, boys. I, I really apologize if the commentary is just not great, but this is a stressful run. Don't fucking telefrag me! How dare you! Fuck you! Telefragging me, little biatch. And all we get as a room reward is a single penny. This better be a good item. I'm gonna throw it down if it's not. Dizzy cap? I don't think that's an active. Hypno ring, it's not. I can't remember what this is. I think this is like sleep shot, which is actually pretty good. Uh, I can't remember exactly what it is, I'll be honest, but I think it's sleep shot. Oh, dude, I completely forgot what these enemies did there. I just kind of let that happen. Okay, third key. Right, let's go open up those chests. This is a slow ash run, my god. Slow ash run. Destroy these real quick. There's a half soul heart, baby. Gimme, gimme. Okay, so two items. Unfortunately, both items are great, and I'd love to actually have them, but I cannot. Can't what cardboard men do. Sleepy, sleepy ring seems really good. It seems like we're getting a lot of sleep going on. Unfortunately, these guys are going to hit me a few times here. There's a lot of slowdown in this room. Yep. There's not much I can do about it. Hoping we get a soul heart out of one of these items. I'm going to just pick it up. We did get a half soul heart. We got a dime. Um... I think I'm just going to take all of this in the bag. Oh, I picked up the dime by accident. My bad. Doesn't matter then. Maybe I'm not. Coupon is an active, sadly. Bursting sack is literally worthless. Coupon is the same thing from before. Fuck me. Stop giving me active items. I don't fucking want them. I'm sure to do this. I can't be asked. Holding on to this for so long. <laughs> and. That's also an active item. God damn game. This is horrible. Stop giving me active items, please. I think that's also another active item. This is this is just silly. Hot bombs, I'll take. Plus five bombs, it's something. And I'm getting a bit sick of this. Dude, what hit me then? Oh, I'd, I'd actually bashed that. Nice. I didn't, I didn't realize I could do that, but it worked. Use mascara. Obviously, we don't care about the item itself. I think I can bomb this for more consumables, right? A single penny, not 
Not exactly the best, but it's something. Okay, into the shop real quick. Buy this. Bursting sack again. Nice to see you again. Oop, coupon again. Nice to see you again. Oh, there's pepper. Dude, it's just the same fucking items over and over again. Leave me alone. Robo baby. It's something. Also, buy half a soul heart, which is terrible value, but whatever. This is the problem with this character. It's just the, the, the most common items give you the same thing over and over and over again. It's like, I don't... I don't want all the actives, for one, obviously. I don't want all these crappy items that you keep offering me. I'm saying no to them for a goddamn reason. Stop. We're chugging along. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. This guy's like guaranteed damage. He just throws fucking fire everywhere. This is only his first phase as well. Like, second phase is so much worse. I definitely need that black heart. Give me that bad boy. It's like, it's like the fucking Mega Satan fight. Like, fuck off. Why you gotta be so brutally difficult? Luckily, we're fucking uh, put him to sleep quite a lot. Right, fucking finally. He's dead. Definitely need the key. Oh, look, it's bursting sack again. Who'd have thunk? I'll take that. Honestly, I didn't want to fight you. Why would I want to fight you? Fuck's sake. Fucking get off me! Okay, apparently I hit twice there. I, I completely beg to differ, but... It's because these goddamn things are completely misaligned. It's really frustrating. Like, completely misaligned. That time I was actually in line with this. I'm not even going to fault, but... It's so bad. I didn't even want to fight this motherfucker. We lost so much health to this guy. I mean, dude, leave it fucking be, you absolute shithouse. Lost so much health there for no goddamn good reason. Ugh. Ugh. This run is pain. What are- dude. We're meant to fight the beast with this. This is gross. This run is hot stank. Oh good, produce a bunch more enemies. That's exactly what I needed. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so horrible. <laughs> this is so horrible. This room's so laggy and this run's so bad. Tainted Kane, why do you have to be such a pathetic piece of crap? You wonder why people don't want to play you. This is why. This is so not fun. It runs so horrible. Right, pop all of these. Hope for a half soul heart from one of them. Try to stave off the enemies that this thing spawns. Oh good, there's enemies all over the place apparently. What's the chances of this thing producing enemies? Because it seems to be very high.
<sighs> Good old half soul heart. We don't know what items we're getting here, so I was just about to say, be prepared to lose the smelter. Of course, we lost it pretty darn quick. I mean, we've got some good things smelted already, but... Was not looking forward to losing the smelter there, but... Just how this character rolls, baby. Driftwood, actually pretty decent. D uh, fuck you. Give me that heart back. Wait, what? There's a sack here, but it's like embedded into the floor or something? I'm confused. Oh god, this room looks awful. Do you know what? Totally a room for this. Kind of made the room worse in a way. Do you want to pop your head up any time soon? There you go, laddie. There you go. I'm still a spider somehow. Oh! Yet another active destroyed. A HP up. I mean, it's not good, but it's something. Oh god. Stressful times, people. Stressful times. Pop your head up, you little shithead. At least the sleep thing is, is like, pretty goddamn good. Seem to be set setting a lot of enemies into their permanent sleep. Which I quite like. It's all just pennies though. All of our room drops are just pennies constantly. Get, get the regrower things back. Oh God, this, we had such good actives. The black hole was like not amazing, but it was pretty good. Smelter was pretty goddamn good. It's all gone away. And Coupon is likely to go away as well. Oh great, I was going to um, use Coupon on an item here, but... Glad that opportunity's gone away. I need to kill this little jumper dude before we kill him, because otherwise he'll just eat all the coins we get from this guy. Not that all the coins we get here are that useful anyways. Stolen placard, we've had that about a million times already, and it's not very good. That's that's actually pretty decent. More opportunity to get red hearts. Oh, fucking, I kind of forgot you did that. I'm going to use the world, because I want to see where our um, item room is. Not item room, uh, secret room. I think that could potentially have some good stuff in it. This run's been a struggle, but if I still had that little hammer thing that I had to start with, it'd be I'd actually be way more okay, because that gave us some good tier effects and stuff, but I had to get rid of that to save my own life. Key, please. Fortunately, the donor thing does nothing for us, so we'll just suck all those up, see what we create. Bottled Fairy. No idea what that does. Um, single use, heals to full. Um, will be used, item will be used automatically on, and we don't sit, get to see the rest. I'm going to guess that means on death.
Either way, it's not good for us, and it's got rid of our active yet again. Not that I care too much about that previous active, but still. Good. Another trinket there. Uh, Whipworm? It's probably pretty decent. Like, shot speed doesn't matter too much, but nice, I guess. Another troll bomb. Gotta love that. Gotta do all the runes we can here, because we need the highest chance possible of creating items. No room reward for that room. Good, good. Oh, dude, you are a fast bugger. What the hell? Fraudulent fungus. It's pretty decent for us. It's just, why? You just always get the same shit. It's a nickel, a few pennies, a few bombs, and a heart. That's like the only things you ever get. Would like those, but a little risky to grab them. Picked up that key for some unknown reason, and now we've got to fight Blue Mum. Uh, and I didn't even get the goddamn full card, so... Really going top tier this, isn't it? I'm probably just going to spawn it in, I'll be honest. This run has annoyed me to no end already. Of course I'm facing the wrong way. I stack up a bunch of shots and I'm facing the wrong goddamn way. Fact of the matter is as well, we've had like basically no damage ups that are like good. I'll take the soul heart. And then we're gonna do spawn. 5.300.1 Get yourself out of there. I'm going to use a bomb because we would have had to use that for our full card, so there you go. Fair's fair. Right, down we go. Bit worried about doing the beast here. I've, I've got to be honest, I'm a bit worried, but... It's the way it got to be. Just, I'm just hoping that during our ascent to the beast floor, we get enough um, consumables to make some genuinely decent items. Got to admit, really not a big fan of this room. But it seems like we're just going to get the same drops as before. Hello, hello. Unfortunately, I can't even afford. I couldn't even afford the item. Why did it let me pick it up? I just wanted the coin in the middle. That's all I wanted. Why did it let me do that? Why is all my room drops just coins? Fuck's sake. This is so horrible. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are these little spiky boys doing? This is a complete complainathon, I realise. But I'm sorry, but the train isn't slowing down anytime soon because this has just been atrocious. <laughs> Fuck off! I need to not get hit for a little bit, but you just don't give up, dear. Oh, look, a room reward penny. At least we got a good item there. That's that's a very good item, but it doesn't do much for the beast fight though. We need a lot more damage stats, specifically a stat. We're gonna do all these shenanigans. 
I still got hit by that feather. Wowee, baby. Wowee. We taking damage like a crazy person. I'm gonna walk right into that one, literally. Didn't mean to pick that up. Okay, gimme gimme. I might have to go back and do all these rooms because I need as many consumables as I can get my hands on. I'm just not getting what I need. I have this fairy bottle here, which I, I, I assume it said that it uses it on death. I'm not 100% sure about that, but that seems to be what it was hinting at. So I'm just going to hope that that's true and hope I don't accidentally delete it when trying to create a new item at some point. Eternal Heart, I think I'll keep. Well, this is goddamn gross. Little buddy fella, I'm going to need you to really pull some punches here, because I can't do much with this guy. Cute. Course, not what I wanted to happen. That's good. Good old dad's dip. <gasps> so stressed out right now. My goodness, right. Do not forget to come back and grab that. That would be a travesty. How long are we on at the minute? 39 minutes. God diggity damn. We just, like, of all the items we've had, Hypno Ring is probably the best thing we have. And Hypno Ring won't even work against the boss, so... What power do we really hold? I'm liking the Rotten Hearts we've got going on at the minute. I think that's helpful. Not liking the rooms that don't give us any drop. This is, this is it for this floor. A bit of lust to end it off. Sadly, a bunch of stuff we cannot afford. Gotta love it. Right, remember to get that Eternal Heart. <sighs> God damn. Been a slog. Absolute slog. This is one of these runs, though, where it's just like... Just fighting for my life. Like, I'm, I'm just... It's not that terrible of a run. It's really not. But, when there's a 16 streak on the line, this is a bad run. <laughs> I literally bought that just so I can put it in my pouch. Yeah, when there's a 16 win streak on the line, this is not a great run. Right. Do this bad boy. Like, we've only got 5.79 damage. That's just not, not, not enough for doing the beast at all, is it? Well, this is a crazy... Fucking room. Do I kill this guy? My goodness. I don't think this is any good. This item that is offered me is what I'm referring to, by the way. The ladder certainly isn't any good for us. I need something that's going to increase my DPS. Do 
Mum's Ring is an it game. Oh my god. Just offers you such trash. I didn't even check what that was. I just picked it up. Could have been really good. I'm going to do this extra room. I know I could take damage, but I need more stuff. Like, we've just had three back-to-back -back absolute stinkers offered to us. Nothing from that room reward, sadly. <sighs> Two pills, three keys, a battery, a card, and a, p a penny should not be giving us mum's coin purse. The way that it's weighted, it just seems to be completely random, but never in your favour. Like, it's not random where it's like, oh, well, you just got Sacred Heart. It's like, no, no, no. It's random because you put up a bunch of good stuff and you get some trash. Also a trinket. That's not what I wanted from a chest, really. Shoop de whoop. Also not what I'm looking for. Telepathy for the dummies. Also, not what I'm looking for. Stop with the goddamn active items. I've told you this already, and you don't goddamn listen. Don't want your shitty active items. Taking that. Back to shoot the whoop again. I didn't realise. Fuck. Um, get rid of a pill for a key, maybe? Nope. That didn't work. Ghost bombs. It's something. <clears throat> it's trash, but it's something. It's it's, it's un it's like just it's unimaginable how just terrible everything it's giving me is. What is this? What kind of a room is that? Just like just give me like a familiar or something that can deal damage, please. Oh, dude, you got this guy as well. Please put him to sleep. This guy's an absolute pain. Wow, two pennies. Out of the possible five I could have got, and I got two. And we got this guy again, who's basically just guaranteed damage for me. Wasn't sure how I meant to get those. Dude, three rooms in a row with the worst possible enemy that you can get on the Ascent. This is... I don't even know what to say. I, I just I, I just don't even know what to say. I'm just, I'm at a loss for words. I just can't. <laughs> I just can't. Come on now, game. You can do better than this. Harlot heart. I'm just going to take. I don't need the actual harlot, but... I'm just going to take. Ugh. The light switch. Ooh, baby. That's what I'm looking for. Guess what? It's another active. Ooh, it's the coupon. We've been missing the coupon. <laughs> and burger bombs? Okay, Monstro... Do I actually want Monstro's Lung? Fuck it, why not? Okay, that's, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I like that. Ugh. Yeah, okay, I think this is pretty good. I think damage-wise, this is an increase to our DPS. Not by a lot, mind you, but I think it is a, an increase. Ooh, that was a good hit. Ooh, that was a really good hit. Okay, boom, boom, boom. 
I have to do all the rooms. Even though some of these enemies are horrible. Don't know why I picked up that penny then, didn't mean to. Oh, I can't get out of the way! Fuck, so it didn't even beat the room, I don't think. Okay, no, it did at least. Ooh. That's something. Taurus! Oh my goodness! How generous! <laughs> Fuck's sake, man. Ugh. Where's the last enemy? Oh, okay, I saw it. I saw it. Last minute, I saw it. Honestly, Monstro's Lung has been kind of a saving grace here. Game Kid. Wow. Taurus again. It just keeps coming back to the same shit. I don't. I know I'm. I, it's because I'm putting the same ingredients in, but it doesn't feel like I am. Don't want Taurus. Nobody ever wants. Dude, what a hit! Don't. Nobody ever wants Taurus. You understand that, right, game? Three dollar bill. Okay. Now we are cooking with gas, people. $3 bill is the first half-decent thing we've had so far. Mo uh, Monstrous Lung, for some reason I was going to call it Mozzarella's Lung for a second there. Don't know why. Um, is good, but not like a great item overall, because it can have some negative impacts. This is a really, really gross room. How did I not take damage there? Uh, but $3 bill, $3 bill is almost entirely positive. There is some small negative potential, but for the most part it's positive. Right. Getting through it. We're getting through it. It's taking quite a bit of time, but we're getting there. Ooh, a troll bomb. Oh, while he's asleep, I can't hit him. That's useful. While he's frozen, I can't hit him. This is just a very annoying enemy to be able to freeze and stun constantly. <laughs> like, he's just getting stunned all the time. I can't do damage to him. Stop! <laughs> Please! Wake up! There you go. Right, away we go. Ba -ba 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 -ba. At least I've got this fairy bottle, which is a full heal. Like, I, I don't trust um, using it, like, letting it auto-use. I am going to just actively use it. But still, it's nice to have, regardless. Bugger shots there to help us out. There's two bombs, lovely. So hard to dodge that attack. Enemies touching you become feared. Okay. Not great. Not great. Oh, it kills sturny boys as well. Now, I don't particularly know how these guys fare. Oh, they're actually pretty weak. Loki's horns. With two luck. Not very useful for us, is it? Really, I shouldn't be doing all the rooms on these floors. These floors tend to be the most difficult. I should just count my stars that I've gone the right way. Right. We are on the last floor now, baby. Holy sugar tits, that was a lot of enemies you pooted out there. I knew we pooted out enemies, but god damn. Okay, not getting any room drops for multiple rooms in a row is a bit annoying. Whoa, that was pretty lovely. 
Wow, that was like the perfect thing to get for that room. This is nice. No, it's not apparently. HP up. I'm just going to take it. I realise that having full coins doesn't do much for us. I probably should have just played that guy. Hot bombs. I could just take another hot bombs. Probably not a good idea though, really. Right. Up we go. This run just is what it is. I'm just hoping we can get through this. Don't have a key for the chest. It's kind of annoying. We heal up here at least. See what we get in our second room here. Copper bombs. Looking piggy thing again. I guess I'll take that. Thank you. It's not ideal, but it's something. The shot speed might be useful, actually. Wowee. Actually, that's fucking amazing. Holy shit. Okay, that might be really good. I don't know how it works with charging up, but that might be really good. It might not work, but either way. Right, anyways, we got good health going into this. I've immediately lost my black heart. That's good. Didn't realize I had fire mind off the bat. Slightly frustrating. Just gonna do the same attack over and over again, buddy. Is that how we're playing this? Unfortunately, it doesn't work the way I thought it would. Are you just gonna do this attack over and over and over again? To be fair, it's kind of preferable to this attack. This attack can be a little bit bullshit. Okay, we got him into second phase already. We only lost a black heart. Just, I was just about to say, just don't fucking spin, spin, spin constantly. Because it's the worst, and you know it is. The good thing is our shots linger in the air, so we might be able to create sort of traps for him to go through. Kind of works. It's not ideal, but it's something. We do keep also sleeping him, which is somewhat useful, although at least a slight, slightly scary situations where, yeah, I was just about to say, where we don't know when he's coming or not, which is exactly what goddamn happened. Just don't do the spinny again. Sometimes he instantly spins again. It's really annoying. Okay, look, we got lucky there. Right, I don't know how we're going to fare against the, the whole beast spiel. Oh, one second. I, I injured myself today. I went running and um, unfortunately buggered up my knee and it's kind of hurting. Stretch it out a sec. It's just like I'm stretching for a run, but I'm stretching for a boss fight. It's kind of sad, but these are the times we live in. Oh, you didn't go the way I thought you were going to go. Good thing is, like I said, the sleep still works. Unfortunately, right now we've slept him off screen, which luckily we can still deal damage to him when he's off screen. Otherwise, that would be very annoying. I think we've just done it again, haven't we? That we have. have I, oh wait, have I have I broken it? Okay, no, we haven't. I heard him do a noise there. But the sleep is very useful. I didn't realize it worked against bosses, but it seems to work very well against bosses actually. Oh good. Okay. Oh, that's one boss done without getting here. I think we're actually okay. My reflection, lovely. Yeah, I think we're actually okay here. We're, we're dealing reasonably good damage. $3 bill is augmenting that occasionally. Um, and we're not taking too much damage right now, at least. Um, and we do have a full heal, should we get low. I said this is just about the best we're going to get. Unfortunately, I've lost my Holy Mantle there due to a fly ball. I, I, I seem to always get hit by those. They, like, spew out at the worst possible times. They're also really just hard to, like, hit past. Because they, they take so much damage. I want to hit the boss, not the, not the fly balls. There you go. We're all good. Okay. Reasonably timely mana to kill you. Create a smorgasbord of shots for him to fly through as he enters the stage. Sleep him immediately as well. 
I think my uh, my little Gorgon boy is also getting some stuns in there on occasion. They seem fairly rare, but I think it is happening. Every now and again, I think I get triple shot and my fire rate goes way down. <laughs> Interesting to sleep in halfway through an animation and it just goes really goddamn slowly. Kind of funny. I think we had pop shot for a minute there. There's a ton of shots here that he's just like chilling near. Actually, like, do you know what? I know you do get a bit of a damage up when you fight the beast, but our damage is pretty respectable with this monstrous lung and three dollar bill setup. Really, towards the end there, we've 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 sort of got lucky with the items we got. Still, just it's, it's a scary time, isn't it? Ooh, yes, fire mine's a good one to stack up fires on him while we can. Oh, dude. A fire rate keeps slightly changing based on $3 bill. So I keep letting go a bit too early every now and again. Oh, dude. That scythe kind of doubled back there. My bad. Oh, we slept him at the perfect time there. Dude, this is such a good combo. The death touch. Looks like we got him there. There you go. Okay. We got the beast with quite a lot of hearts left. I think we're okay. I think we just about got away with this. I know this was a complainy run, and I know a lot of you don't like the complainy runs, but can you blame me, really? Is it really that surprising that I complained a lot on this run? Oh my god. We did a ton of damage there. Whatever $3 bill shots we got are lingering over him. Parasite shots by the look of it. Seems to do a lot of damage. Unfortunately, we don't have bombs to use right now. Does, can we, I guess say, can the parasite shot stop right now? Because the game is lagging like crazy. This is just going to be a war of attrition now. We've just got to sort of wait until we finish. Hope that $3 bill gives us reasonably good stuff. Fire mind is a good one for the fires. Stay there for a long time. Ooh, the sleep does fuck with this. I forgot about that. Sleep again. Parasite shots again. Parasite isn't great because it just lags like crazy. It does good damage, but... I think we got fire mine somewhere in there. Oh, have we... oh we've entered last phase already. Okay. That's unexpected. I'm very happy about that. We've got triple shot at the minute. We're firing very slowly. But yeah, and this, this is just victory lap. I've never understood why this is the final phase. It's such a silly last phase. Just like all the rest of it's not hard, but like not easy. And then this is just like, meh. I'm just going to be super, super easy. Do you know how these used to fall before? I'm not going to fall anymore. Why would they bother? Well, there you go. We got through that. Don't know how, but we did it. My god, that was tricky. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.